It's your boy, Lankoi Warrior Kamal. And I am back with another video. And today's Throwback Thursday video is going to be about this game right here. I know a lot of y'all remember this game WCW vs. NWO Revenge. One of the things I like about this game is that it has who's on the front cover of the game. It has Hulk Hogan, Kevin Nash, Raven, and Goldberg on the front cover of it. Another thing I like about WCW versus NWO Revenge is that it has like five or six different modes that you can choose from. Another thing I like about this game right here is it, it you can adjust the music settings on this game right here. And also, another thing that I like about this game, which I think is pretty dope, pretty cool, is that THQ made this game. And if you don't know who THQ is, THQ was a wrestling company that made video games. And THQ made this game. And it has all of the NWO members on it. That's another thing I like about WCW vs. NWO Revenge. Is it has all of the NWO members on it. And NWO black and white members on this game. And this game also has... The other NWO, NWO Wolf Pop on a game. And this game has a lot of legendary wrestlers like Hawk Hogan, Goldberg, Rey Mysterio, Eddie Guerrero, Chris Jericho. Chris Benoit, Rick Steiner, Harlem Heat, just to name a few of the wrestlers that are on there. Those are some of the legends that are on this game, WCW. Versus NWO Revenge. Another thing I like about this game right here is they got a lot of the classic pay per views on this game right here. They got Halloween Havoc on 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 the game. They got. Starcade on this game. They got... I think Great American Bosch is on this game also. And another thing I like about this game is that they, everybody on this game... Whether it's in the, the NWO roster... The NWO Black and White... Or NWO Wolf Park, or any other wrestler that was wrestling in WCW at the time that this game right here came out. They all have the finishing moves on this game. And another thing I like about this game is that you can make people bleed on this game. You could bust people open and make people bleed on this game right here. And also, 
Another thing that I like about this game right here is that they have a lot of the signature championships on this game right here. Which I also thought was pretty dope and pretty cool. That they had a lot of the signature championships on this game right here. And another thing that I like about this game right here is that you can pick out weapons from the crowd and get weapons from the crowd on this game right here. Which I also thought that was pretty dope and pretty cool about this game right here. Is that you can pick weapons from it. That's pretty dope and pretty cool to me. Now, if I had to rate this game on a scale of 1 to 10, I would definitely rate this game right here a 10 out of 10. It is a classic and it is the best WCW game that was ever made. And if you don't have this game, if you have a Nintendo 64 and you don't and you like wrestling games, or even if you just like WCW in general, I would highly recommend you get this game if you have a Nintendo 64. This game is a classic, and it's one of the best wrestling games ever. And if you want to purchase this game, you probably will have to go to Amazon.com or a pawn shop in your city where you live, because they don't sell Nintendo 64 games up video game stores anymore.